My name is Carol Sanderson. I'm the owner of Kasambo Exclusive Guest Lodge. We are situated just outside of Nelsraid and uh, just five minutes from Kruger Mpumalanga International Airport and uh, around 45 minutes from the nearest Kruger Gate. I believe that Kasamba Exclusive Guest Lodge is the jewel of the low field. So if you do come here, you will feel as if you're taking a break away from the ordinary. Uh, into something that is uh, totally different. You'd feel as if you're in some kind of an island, yet you are just right inside of Nels Raid, and that's just the beauty of the low felt. When we started staying here, and when we did decide to turn the space into business, uh, already there were existing uh, wooden chalets that were already built here. So we then decided we're going to then continue with that line. What is beautiful about it is each and every one of it is self-contained, it's in its own space and you've got the most beautiful, luxurious view of the low field, including the mountains. And you also have to, you get to enjoy the smell of the citrus fruits that uh, are surrounding, you know, uh, the, the property itself. But then uh, we decided because, you know, sometimes you have a client that loves the bush. So that is the perfect space for them. And then you have a client that is more afraid of the bush and whatever that comes with it. So then we built new accommodation for them, uh, which is actually closer to the reception area. Kasambo, when we bought Kasambo, this was our home. It was a family home and we wanted to grow our kids here. But seeing the beauty and the landscape, the rocks, the old trees, the roots, uh, that itself encouraged me that uh, in my family that why don't we just share it with the outside world. That's when I then started to go as creative as I could. It was my first project and uh, I wanted to create what I am seeing, what I've been visioning, what I'm feeling. And that's how then the art within Kasambo also came along. My background, I'm a journalist by profession, <clears throat> so I started following the ads even while I was still in the newsroom. And I felt that when Kasambo was created, now that I have the space, why not? Why don't I bring what I've been talking about for all these years? Why don't I bring them together? So that's how the jam session actually came about. Uh, I brought a few musicians together and uh, we created the idea. and. My husband was more worried about how do we make money out of that. <laughs> but you know how creatives are. Uh, how you make money is actually the last thing you think about. It's the passion that actually drives you. So we've been running a jam session for the past four years now. And uh, some of these artists, they've got invites to national, they got invites to international shows, you know, of which that's what fills my heart, that's what gives me goosebumps and that's what uh, gives me that uh, endless smile uh, when I wake up because you have changed somebody's life and the very same person will also help and take somebody's hand uh, when they actually make it. Mm -hmm.